Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Nintendo Lee, a Nintendo podcast by me, Lee. Um, so it's just about that time, direct time. Well, okay, okay. I know I'm starting too early. Before we talk about that, let me talk about what I've been playing. Um, been playing. Wow, I feel like quite a bit, quite a bit. Uh, Pokemon Shield. Still going at it, trying to get all the Pokédex, fill the Pokédex. Um, really, I feel like I haven't done much with it recently. I've done a couple here and there, like added a couple more, but my main focus has been, honestly, the DS. I'm back on it, the 3DS. Uh, Bowser's Inside Story was on sale. I picked it up, been enjoying it. Pretty good game. I really like the gameplay, but uh, the story kind of like it's just okay right now. now. I'm not too far into it. Maybe I don't know five, ten hours into it. Uh, I don't know how long this game is, so that could be very little, or it could be halfway through the game. Uh, I am trying to hoping to beat it soon because I would like to complete the Pokédex before Animal Crossing comes out. No, I could, if I just sit down and do it, I'm pretty sure I can get the Pokédex down pretty quick. Uh, also, speaking of Animal Crossing, I've been playing more New Leaf. My goodness, I'm just ready. I'm just ready for New Horizons. It's gonna be it's so good. March twentieth. It's gonna be. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. I can't wait. So I am filling the void of No Animal Crossing with New Leaf until New Horizons come out. Uh, but other than that, oh, Dauntless. Can't skip Dauntless. My goodness, I am. If you watch my last video, I'm hooked on this game. My goodness, I'm very much enjoying it. It is, it's, it's honestly like a breath of fresh air for the Switch for me right now. Because, uh, uh, I consider this like the game as a service type game. And other games I was playing that are as a service was Tetris 99, Warframe every now and then, and Rocket League every now and then. And as much as I love those, I still love those. Dauntless is just, man. Oh, I don't know. It's good. I love the quick pace. I haven't played any of that this week. I need to play some of that because, my goodness. I played, last play I played was the weekend. I put a lot of time into it on the weekend. Played a lot. Uh, so that's gonna be that's gonna it's gonna happen. Some more is gonna get into it, and I'm gonna take down some more beasts because I am the Slayer. Check it out if you haven't, because my goodness, it's so good. Uh, but that's all I've been playing. Quite a bit more than usual. I know usually I'm just playing like one, one game and jumping into a game of service every now and then. But I'm trying to get some stuff beat before Animal Crossing. Cause Animal Crossing is gonna it's gonna sweep the field, honestly. Uh, well, let's see. We got some news to talk about. Uh, one, oh, well, we got some new, one news, <laughs> one new, one new. Uh, and then we have, uh, some rumors, leaks, per se. So the one new, the one news <laughs> is Luigi's Mansion 3 is getting multiplayer DLC. That is awesome and if you follow me on twitter you know i've been i've been i've been tweeting the twitter has been active of uh where was super Mar- i mean super mario party where was this dlc at nintendo just announced that luigi's mansion 3 got dlc and uh even cadence of hyrule got dlc a free dlc update where was super mario Party's? And someone tweeted back at me. It's like, you know what? They're probably just making Super Mario Party 2. Which I'm down for. But man, some DLC. Just like, they could have DLC'd it. And make it last a little longer. Put more work into Super Mario, make it, I mean, Super Mario Party 2. Man, that would have been good. Like 10 bucks and get me like an extra board. And maybe some extra mini games. Even another character. $15 for all that, I would be down. 
but we'll see. Nintendo is just now, like, they're trying to dip their toes into DLC. I know they've done it before, of course, but this is them. I think the Switch is really where they're going to, I guess, peak with some DLC. And sooner or later, they're going to they're gonna hit the good spot where they're just have the game out and they go, boom, the DLC you wanted. Instead of going, ooh, we thought about DLC, but we made another game. But in some case, it does work with, like, Breath of the Wild 2 coming because I'm pretty sure they're going to be like, hey, well, most of this was we thought about making DLC, but we came up with the whole idea for another game. It was that would be great on its own. It works in that scenario, but also just give us some DLC. Throw a little bit at us. Even Mario Maker 2 got that, like, little DLC with, uh, well, it's little but also big because it added Zelda. <sighs> well, it added Link, but, you know, Zelda the game. It's kind of Zelda Maker almost. And it's like a tad way. <sighs> anyway, enough about DLC. That could be its own own episode about one day. But we do have one leak rumor area situation of a uh, Master Chief Collection coming to Switch. So King Zell, I feel like we all know by now, he's uh, a well-known leaker. He came back for a little bit where uh, someone commented and says, Oh, King Zell, you're back. He's like, No, I'm just stopping by to say hello. Halo. Halo. And then moments later, Sabi on Twitter tweeted out, He's been hearing a lot of things of Master Chief Collection coming to Switch, and it's good to see King Zell support it as well like the support the the uh, leakers letting them know things so is it happening i really hope so but they uh didn't announce it at the game awards someone asked king zell that and he said uh neither nintendo or xbox like that at the game awards because you know they want to focus on their own bigger stuff and not recognize something for one another uh but a direct could be possible. Now, to go back to my beginning statement of this episode, um, a direct, is it soon? I think so. I think it is. Because usually after an indie direct, which was the indie world like a week or two ago, usually shortly after that, like max a month or so, we get... A full-blown direct and I think especially like the Wii U 3DS games January we got a big direct and I want to say it was just like maybe just last year we didn't we got one in February it was late but I think this time around I think it's different I think Nintendo wants to show off a lot of games this year because you know we got the PS4 I mean PS5 and the Xbox Series X coming out this, uh, this holiday, who knows when, this holiday, but I do think Nintendo is going to be like, wants to show off games, 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 hey look, those consoles are new, we have games, we have a bunch of games, we got Breath of the Wild 2, we got, who else, we have uh, Pikmin 3, we have Master Chief Collection on Switch, on the go, so that's what I'm thinking, I'm thinking it's going to be soon, uh, man, but a date, I'm up. I'm going to guess a date. I'm going to throw a random guess out there uh, that I do think it might be. Well, see, I think I don't think it would be around the first. Like maybe the week after the first. So the second week of January. What well, You know what? It could be the first, like January 1st. It could be. Like January 2nd, boom, direct. Because, okay, here's what I'm thinking. I do think they might want to do a direct before Tokyo Mirage Session come out. So they can kind of slide a little something to Tokyo Mirage Session in there and give a little, get a little hype push. And maybe they'll say something at the end like, oh, we got the next Smash character. 
Oh, no, I do think, okay, um, it will definitely be early January. Because these, okay, we got Smash character. Needs to be revealed soon-ish and come out by February. Because they said it's coming February 2020. If they push the last DLC character, I won't be mad. You know, take your time, do what you need to do. Uh, but also, give us that Smash 5 character. Uh, so, okay, I'm no, final answer. I'm going early January. I'm going first week of January. The first is on a Wednesday. So either re- the between that Wednesday and Friday or the next week. Leaning preferably to the next week, but it could be possible in that first one. I really think it's happening. And I think we are legit going to get the Master Chief Collection. It was rumored way back then. It's coming back with two known leakers saying stuff about it. I think we are getting it. I think we will get Smash Character 5. And what the heck? I think we're getting Pikmin 3 and Metroid Prime Trilogy. Throwing those out there. I really want those too. So, yeah. Leave a comment down below what you think will be coming or when the Direct is coming. Hit that like button. And don't forget to subscribe. Until next time, peace.